Just before the video starts, the next episode, the final episode of the series, will be a complete Q&A. So any questions you have regarding whether it's rugby, what the level was like, the trainings, what day did I train, um, or if it's outside of rugby, what did you do day to day life, what job did you get, what visa did you take, flight costs, contract talks, how did I contact, literally anything and everything, post it in the comments, I'll reply to it in the next video. You can either do it right now or at the end of the video. There's a reminder at the end of the video. And yeah, post it in and I'll answer it. And I'll add in anything I feel you should know. So yeah, back to the video. All right. Good morning, people. Good morning. So, there's a home game. Time for a home game. Not gonna be a long video. <laughs> Not much to show. Um, obviously with the new players, I can't. <laughs> You can't just rock up three weeks after throwing a camera in everyone's face. It's gonna stay, is that gonna stay? Um, so yeah, anyway, home game against Marist Old Boys, I think they're called. Really strong team, they have an all black in their team, Adam Thompson, throw on the screen right now. So he's still kicking about 40 years old, which is amazing. Um, that's one of the things I love about playing here. It's just incredible that the players you play against. Like they told me last season, they were playing in the semi-final. Carlos Spencer, you don't know who he is, you should do, was on the bench, which is mad. Um, we've also been told that in a few weeks, Liam Messon is gonna come play for us because he wants his 100th cap for Waikato, the rep team in the area. And um, in order to get in the team, you have to play club rugby. So he's gonna come to us and obviously, you know, he'll jump in the team and that'll be, Anyway, so I'm just traveling to the stadium now. We've got a kind of coffee meet up at 11.20. Um, and then clap the bees out, watch the first half, and then start warming up for us. 2.45 p.m. kickoff. Um, what else can I say? The weather was sunny since I've just gone in the car now. The rain has started to pop out, which is beautiful. Exactly what we don't want. Uh, your boys jumping back in at 10 this weekend. First game I started off, um, came on at second half at 15. Coach said that it would be best, um, easier for me to get into the game so I can watch, see how the boys play, see the moves, as opposed to jumping straight in at 10. And you know, just, it would be very hard to just get straight into that, especially with the change of game, how they play around it, it's not as structured. But that's for another video. I would talk all about that. I've had many questions, what the comparison is. Um, second game, I play 15 up to 70 minutes and I played 10 in the last 10 minutes and now this is the third game and I'm slotting in at 10. Um, so yeah obviously when I came over I, we did a FaceTime and I was like I'm a 12, I am, I am a 12, that is my position. Um, he was like well I think you should be over mine in 10, 12, 13. Obviously the Waikido, the rep team here are looking for a 10 um, so yeah, that could be a way in and obviously that would be incredible if that did ever happen. But. Um, but yeah, I was I was open to jumping to 10. I saw what they kind of needed and missed. Um, so I don't mind jumping in better than 15. Uh, 12's already there. Bola, he's solid, played for Tonga. Um, so yeah, there's no moving that guy. Um, but anyway, happy to drop in at 10 first game. So yeah, it's been a, a while. Been a season last season, the season before in Chateau Renard. That's when I played 10, only four games before COVID struck us. But yeah, so. Since stadium. So I think this is a spot they go to normally just for the coffee before a game. So yeah, just chill here for like an hour, I think. Oops. <laughs>
let's get it. Okay, I'm on the time limit. I'm on the time frame. Out of my mind, man. Do what I gotta do. I ride the ride, man. I right, cool. Hey. Coming out of hiding soon, different look, new attitude Five tunes for y'all's consumption, BB gon' get it jumping Drop my nuts, got some gumption, we up to something And what it is to be seen, best believe you would be pleased Heard my shitty been in search of a renaissance, hard to find They whitewashing history in front of our eyes Mr. Brown here to keep it clear, it's black and white But even in the fine print, shit get lost in plain sight Far from colorblind, but the green been blurring my vision Whether it's what I'm smoking on or trying to get to these binges Been in this game for quite a while, sick of riding the Don't let me get some playing time, I'm letting it fly in this world renowned hometown hero I'm the reason why they rapping now, keep it real though While it was burning the flames, I helped keep the foundation solid These days I'd rather be more honest than modest Slick bothered by the fact they tried to count me out Luckily the math ain't adding up, so what you talking about? Chitter chat around the way, his daddy dropping soon 808s and heartbreaks for them, that's some really bad news But don't be paranoid, real spill, you know how to be filled with joy It's the return of the trill, I hope Pimp will be proud of the boy Legit underground king, I know it's hard to ignore R.I.P. Big Pokey while my mind swinging Hand the rope to anybody who ever tried to leave me hanging B.B. gon' profit as far, just know we on the rise Trying to mash your disgust, but we can see through your disguise A word to the wise, I better get your shit together Got everything to gain that this Point is now or never. Yeah, I got everything to gain at this point. It's now or never. Coming out of hiding soon. Different look, new attitude. Five tunes for y'all's consumption. BB gon' get it jumping. Drop my nuts, got some gumption. We up to something. What it is to be seen. Best believe you will be pleased. Sheesh. Smarter than that. Infinity.